Hey, it's Ken Gagne with YouTube channel GameBits here to play one of my favorite Xbox 360 games. Going a little bit back in time today for a Sega classic, and that Ferrari name is the reason why you can't play the game anymore, and that game is Outrun Online Arcade. came out in April 2009 and was delisted from the Xbox Store in December of 2011, a scant two-and-a-half-year window that you had to find this game in the Xbox Store. It is based, of course, on the classic Sega arcade game, Outrun, and it features some online multiplayer, which I doubt even works anymore, because who's going to be playing a game that hasn't been available for four years? But it's a classic arcade-style racing game, and I'm going to take it for a quick spin just to show you what you're all missing. Automatic to show off a game I have that you don't. Uh. So Outrun mode is the classic mode, so of course we're going to go with that. And some classic tunes here. Some uh, originals that I'm sure you've heard. Let's go magical. with Magical Sound Shower. So the point of the game is to get through five different areas yeah, of the course. So our triggers go, and left and right steer, and off I go. And after a certain amount of time, you reach a branching path and you are asked to go left or right. And if you go right, the game gets harder. If you go left, it gets not as hard as if you went right. And so there are, let's see, five factorial many levels. I believe that's 25. Doing a little bit of a Tokyo Drift there. And you only get to encounter five of the levels on a single playthrough. Oops, get off the sand. Now, I don't believe that there is any boost that I can use. There's, uh... Yeah. And, uh, shortcuts are seldom. But now they're recommending if I want easy, I go left. And so I did. And I'm right behind my rival here. I'm slipstreaming, which means I'm in the air tunnel behind him. If that's what we want to call it. Air vacuum, I'm not sure. And, uh, that speeds up my speed a little bit. And just enough so I can pass. You do get bonuses whenever you pass it without hitting it. There is a heart attack mode where you're challenged to collect hearts on the course. The game does feature some, uh, I don't know if you would call it mild sexism, perhaps, but it's a male protagonist always behind the wheel, and his girlfriend is in the passenger seat, and she gets very excited when you pull off certain moves. Let's see. So, it looks like I'm sort of in a San Francisco type area. Of course, I went across what appeared to be the Golden Gate Bridge, and now it's very hilly. And your arrival is always changing. Oh! And like a cat, you always land on your wheels. Um, that metaphor didn't quite end up the way I expected it to. But every time you hit something, it slows you down, and that takes away from the time you have to get to the goal. So I'm going to go for the complete easiest path because I haven't played this game in a couple of years, uh, and uh, it certainly takes me a while to warm back up to it. Not in terms of enjoying it, just in terms of getting my groove back, kind of like Stella. So now I'm entering the Water Falls stage. And here we are. And every time I pass a, a finish line or a goal post or a milestone, it adds some more time. So this kind of looks like a level from Need for Speed, perhaps, but uh, off the opposite the graphic fidelity is really different. Because this is just an Xbox Live Arcade game. Uh, not quite the same budget as a big game from is it EA that makes Need for Speed. Uh, there's a Need for Speed game from, I think, 2009 on Xbox 360, so same year as this game, perhaps, that uh, some of my buddies and I play online quite regularly. Uh, I know there have been more Need for Speed games since then, probably better ones, but, you know, after you've unlocked a certain number of cars, you don't want to start all over. And really, the game is just an excuse to chat with your because you haven't chatted for a while and you want to catch up, and I almost went right that time. Which would not have been all that bad a thing. But Lost City. Uh, maybe if I'm successful at this run, I'll give it another one and show you some other ones. Whoa! That hill just popped out of nowhere. So this Lost City kind of reminds me of when I went to Machu Picchu. And if you check out my YouTube channel for the video Ken Gagne at the Moth Accidents, you'll learn that... I had just bought a new DSLR camera to go to Machu Picchu with, and that camera was the one with which I shot my very first unboxing video, which unofficially launched this whole channel. Ow. You know, 
off me. So if it weren't for Machu Picchu, there might not be YouTube channel game bits. How bizarre is that? So I'm happy to be racing here. Doing my Tokyo Drift right past my rival. Yeah, rocking my controller back and forth, left and right. Winning my girlfriend's heart for driving dangerously. 15 seconds left on the clock. And am I going to get the clock extended? Where? Ah, uh, giant statues. No. Uh-oh. Five. Four. Six string. Three. Two. Come on. Oh, they don't let you run on fumes at all. Dang. Okay, so I could definitely could have done better. And now she's berating me and actually appeared to be physically beating me, which is not very kind. Game over. Game over, man. Game over. All right, I'm gonna just for uh, poops and giggles go into multiplayer mode, which I'm not sure I've ever actually done, and just see if there is anybody online. Uh, I don't need to invite my friends because I'm certainly not going to have any friends who are playing this game. There was actually a brief download for this game, an update, when I launched it at the beginning of this Let's Play. 784k. Uh, I have played this game in the last year, not extensively. Uh, let's do a quick, maybe, uh, heart attack mode, I believe it's called. Let's go with a more F50. classic car, the convertible. Automatic transmission. Heart attack. What a terrible name for a level. I mean, that's mode. something that actually kills people. Splash wave. Splash wave. Don't crash into other vehicles. This is kind of like a game pro pro tip. Yeah, Don't eat the enemy. Shoot him until he blinks. Really? Okay. So now we have our girlfriend's silhouette in the lower right corner and the number of hearts that we have earned of hers, I suppose. So uh, it's cardiac acquisition time. Start. Where are those hearts? Where? Oh, that's right. They're not actually on the track. It's all about how you can drive. So, slip screaming, driving past vehicles without hitting them. All these maneuvers earn you hearts. Oops. All the while, you're apparently still doing the traditional outrun race. So, there are certain segments, I see, where heart attack mode starts and stops on the course. You have to earn as many hearts as you can in that period. And I did AAA in that one. So now this is a drift as much as you can, and I did. So let's show you some levels you haven't seen before. So I earned AAA on both our attack opportunities. And a uh, goal! She raised her hand. It's a score. We're good. All right, so now we're in the National Park. Ah, a little bit of a... Wow, graphic fidelity kind of choked right there. Now, this this is the part where it ma does matter what part of the level the track we're racing on. I did terribly right there. Let's take a C. I would have given myself a D. And here we go again. She wants me to slipstream and not hit other vehicles. Yes, AAA. All right, which is not an auto club I support, by the way. I recommend Better World Club, which gives you a discount if you have a hybrid, and they'll cover your bicycle in addition to your car, because I'm earthy crunchy like that. Give me my granola. Rank A. So AAA plus C divided by two is A. So Big Forest, another level you've never seen. Wave your hands in the air like you collect just don't care. Uh-oh, collect the points. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, man. That was terrible. B, you're far too generous. I don't deserve you. Keep passing the cars. So that's my goal for this heart attack. Every heart attack is a different goal. This one is pass them cars. And I'm not really passing all that many. I hit a few. One more, one more. Ah, uh, missed it. Oh! I'm so focused on my score, I forgot to watch the road. Sure, slap me. I just flip the car, we're, and all you do is slap me. We're both fine, but you still slap me anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna retract my... What was I supposed to do? Whatever. Okay. Uh, I totally whiffed on that last heart attack. I don't even know what I was supposed to do. E. E for excellent, right? No, E for awful. That's 
Baseball. 16 seconds left to get to Casino Town. Here we are at the checkpoint. It rained recently. Go through the gate. And they still go through the gates. Whoops. Uh. <laughs> hey, I went through two. If I had accidentally knocked myself off the course. Collect coins. Whoops. Dang. Oh. Man, Casino Town. Lady Luck is not on my side tonight. I wonder if this is harder or easier than just the regular outrun mode. Drift more. Drift more. Oh. Yeah, triple A. That's what I'm good at then. Drifting. Uh oh. Ten seconds to get to the checkpoint. Ah oh, man, this is way too reminiscent of my last playthrough of this game. I'm gonna end at like 93%, aren't I? Ah. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Just throttle me. Rank C. C total. She's not happy with me. Yeah, the uh, sexism that I thought was mild, maybe not so much. Game over. That was basically Ken and Barbie take a ride. So, anyway, so that is Outrun Online Arcade. I have many of the achievements, but not all of them. In fact, not most of them. Reached any goal in manual, arrived at all the goals. I have done that. And achieved any goal in automatic. And then the rest are scoring overall AAA, one million points. Time attack mode in under four and a half. Fifteen course continuous outrun mode. Wow. Do the whole thing in under fourteen and a half minutes. Wow. Be first at all junctions on a multiplayer match. That's never going to happen again. I'll never get 100% on this. Five multiplayer in a row. Complete 50 single player games. I've never done that. Really? Drive above 186 miles per hour for 10 seconds. I should be able to do that. But not today, because that is the end of this tour of Outrun Online Arcade. So thanks so much for watching YouTube channel Game Bits. Sega!